Hey guys, it's me, Noah, and Domino here, and and I just wanted to update you guys on what's been going on with me and Domino in the past however long it's been since I've uploaded a video. <laughs> so, last time, so a lot has changed. Domino's diet has changed a lot, and I'm doing a lot more to Make sure Domino has a better house. I'm starting to weigh him. I think I may start thinking about starting to get Domino through nice, good checkups every once in a while. Just to make sure he's healthy. I think that would be good. I'm still thinking about it. But a big thing that was happening that's happening is now the CNC cage I was, I've been talking about forever is now official. I'm now officially getting it. What we're actually going to be doing tomorrow is that we have a Home Depot that actually sells Coralplast. So we're going to be visiting it tomorrow. And we are going to be getting a sheet of Coralplast. It's going to be, I think it's going to be 4 feet by 8 feet. Because my cage is going to be 3 by 3. So which will actually be big enough for two guinea pigs because I'm actually considering adopting another guinea pig. Now, something I made a big mistake on when I got Domino was the fact that Domino was actually a was actually a guinea pig that was bought from the store. He wasn't adopted, which really I regret, but well, I regret it, but I don't regret it. One sec. Sorry, phone thing. I regret getting a guinea pig from the store, but I don't regret actually getting this specific guinea pig. I mean, this guinea pig is like the star of my world. I love him so much. He has a great attitude. He is just the sweetest little thing. See, he's not scared of me or anything. Oh, he even knows when to come to me. See, look. Come back, come back. See, he's so sweet. He comes to me for protection all the time. <laughs> he just climbs on me. He's so cute. So yeah, his cage will be 3x3. Three three, and I am very excited for it because I'm so ready to get the just throw actually not not throw away, but just not use the the store box cage, which I'm really excited about. So what finally got my parents to actually say yes to the whole CNC cage thing, because really last time I've been telling you guys about it, my parents have been saying no about it. And okay, so as I was saying about how I got my parents to let me get the CNC cage, was that, uh Donald pooped on my bed. Why should I throw it? <laughs> Okay, so what actually got my parents to say yes was that one thing that I really, that worked for me was showing them what I actually wanted. Because just telling them about the cage, they just said no. They said that he would just poop everywhere and stuff. Which really, they, yes, they will have more room to poop, but the poop will be spread out more, which was my point about that. Problem solved. And they said it'd be harder to clean. Well, that's not at all true. I've had experience cleaning CNC cage suits because recently I've started volunteering at my local rescue in Louisville called the Texas Wrestlers. They are so awesome. And I'm, it was just so much fun volunteering there today. I got to meet a lot of great people and a lot of great guinea pigs and bunnies and chinchillas and gerbils and all that. So that is great. And, and what else was... They actually got to see the CNC cages, so they actually saw what I wanted in person, which is kind of what I wanted to do. That was a that was another main goal of me volunteering there, was to show my parents about CNC cages and what they were. So I also showed them a picture on Google of what I wanted. I showed them a picture of the three by three. They actually seemed interested, but but the. 
But today, when I went to go volunteer there, today was actually my first day work volunteering there. I just showed them what I wanted, and they're like, yeah, actually, we can get it for you. And I'm just so happy now. So let me just show you where the cage will actually be. So that so that corner over there is going to be where the CNC cages will be. If you're wondering if that will be enough space, actually that is the exact space. So, yeah. Donna's being a little whiner. Hmm. Let's see if I can get in the purr. Got him to calm down. This is kind of why I want more. Oh, he's so cute. 